Ha! Huh? I'm Mr. Money. Welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto 5 online video. Some guy just came along and just blew up my car. Not exactly sure why, though. I'm in passive. But, guys, it is super early in the morning right now. We have two new vehicles that came out today. We have the Oppressor Mark II and the Terabyte. In this video, we're going to be buying our new Terabyte. I don't really want to buy this thing. I don't really see any use for it. It reminds me of the MLC, and apparently it's just like the MLC. But in order to get the Oppressor Mark II for its trade price and save a million dollars, you have to own a Terabyte and complete five client jobs. And I'm assuming you're probably going to need this thing to customize this thing. I, I'm pretty sure that the only thing you can customize this with so you kind of have to have it to make it look even cooler as well so we're gonna buy this thing i don't know how much it's gonna cost in the end hopefully it doesn't cost too much i'm hoping not over five million dollars i mean there's a lot of crap going on here but i'm very excited about the drone and everything so let's take a look at all these jobs get the get the job done okay cool uh ooh. That one's kind of cool. It's like a pinkish type of thing. I like that one i don't really see many colors in here like i feel like they're just like repeating like these are two green ones these are kind of cool oh god i don't like that one at all i like the orange i like this one too but these ones just look the same to me why? I don't really like these ones, but I, I kind of like the pink one the most. Pink or orange? Or blue? Or green? Or this one? <laughs> uh, I'm just going to go with pink. I like the pink one. I'm all pink. All right, let's go with pink. Uh, interior decal. Then they, wow, they gave a lot of choices. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell. You can't even see anything with that one. There's nothing even there. I don't understand. <laughs> There's nothing there. Am I blind or is there nothing there? I don't see nothing up there. Uh, let's see here. Man, it was a little noisy out there. People must be getting in trouble. Ooh, I like that one. Reminds me of a snake, yeah. Ooh, I like that. I'm gonna have to go back to that. Uh, I feel like some of these textures aren't loading in. See what I'm saying? Oh, it's on the floor. I'm stupid. There's floor ones. Now I see it. it's on the. I was expecting the wall. The rest of them are on the wall. Okay, so make sure when you look at these ones, they're on the floor. Okay, I see. I want more of a wall one though. Ooh, I kind of like that one. That one looks pretty cool. Ooh, I like that one too. Butterflies. That looks kind of cool. They look like bats to me though. Uh. I think I'm going to go with that one. I, I like this one. They're butterflies, but I'm going to call them bats, and only will know. <laughs> All right, let's go here. Uh, the turreted station. Let's go with it. Sure, why not? It looks pretty cool. I don't know why I would really need it. I, if it can't take out a Hydra or something like that, if Rockstar's put something like that in the game, that'll be pretty cool. But probably can't really take out much, other than like maybe a helicopter that a homing launcher can take out. Drone station? Sure, dude. I'm very, very excited about the drone. $815,000. I guess. I, I, I guess. I've seen action of that thing, and I guess it can tase people, and you can self-destruct it and blow people up. It looks pretty freaking cool. We're getting that thing 100%, because we're going to have to make some videos out of that and troll some people. It's going to be a great time. Uh, the weapon workshop, I'm personally not going to buy. Uh, I don't think there's any need for it if you already have the MOC, which I do. Um, unless Rockstar adds guns in the game that can only be modified in here, then I'll buy it, but right now I don't see the need to buy it. If they add guns in the game, I could just come back and buy it. But for right now, I'm just going to save my money because I'm pretty sure I could just do it inside my MOC, and I really don't think there's any bit of a difference. Uh, I, I I recommend you guys do the same. Uh, Special Vehicle Workshop, I'm pretty, yep, yeah, it's the only place to uh, customize the Oppressor Mark II. So yeah, we have to get that thing $495,000. Man, Rockstar, they're a bunch of thieves. So $3.1 million. Not as expensive as I thought it was going to be. I thought everything else was going to be very expensive. I was thinking the drone was going to be more of the turret station. Everything was going to be a little bit more, but apparently not. All right, let's buy this thing. I think it looks dope. All right, let's get it. Pending purchase. Wow, a lot of money. Oh, my God. I'm going to go below $10 million a day. That kind of sucks. So we got a new contact page, and your new terabyte is now available. I don't know where to get the terabyte. I'm pretty sure it is inside my nightclub. That's why I'm at my nightclub right now. So I'm going to head inside, and we're going to see if we can find that thing. All right, guys, we're in our terabyte floor. We're on floor five. I guess this is like a new floor, a new secret floor. I think it looks pretty dope. Can we customize this thing? I don't know that for a fact. Uh, how do I, how would, I, think, I think you can. I mean, this thing right here. I don't know what that is. Let's go inside, though. I don't know if I'm going inside or customizing it, but I'm assuming you can customize this thing and make it look cool. I mean, you, we are, you were able to do it with the MLC, but let's go inside and check it out real quick. I'm talking to you live from... You don't need to know where. This is your truck, a vehicle I designed and assembled from the keyboards to the codes the systems run on. We should have everything in here we need to take down any score we want. To the rear, you've got a specialized vehicle workshop. You can modify an Oppressor Mark II back there if you want to buy one. I mean, it's 100%. just a flying bike with twin machine guns, but I guess that's not everyone's bag. You just jump on the bike to modify or deploy it directly from the Terabyte. We could put a weapons workshop over here. For the kinds of jobs I have planned, you're going to need some serious hardware. But I understand if you want to wait and see. The workshop would allow you to buy and upgrade a range of weaponry into superior Mark II variants. Or make them look pretty, if that's what you're into. Now, that big touch screen in the center of the room is where you should really be looking. We'll QB everything we're doing from there. So, log on when you're ready, and I'll talk you through it. 
All right, cool. That was pretty cool. So that must have been Paige. This place is kind of cool. I like all the pink. It just looks kind of funny in here. I like it. I, I want to call those bats up there. I, I, they look like bats to me. Ah, I guess they kind of look like... Okay, so the first one looks like a bat to me, and the other one looks like a moth. How are these butterflies? <laughs> they look like moths to me. All right, let's get outside here. I want to see if I can customize this thing. Oh, what was that? What was that? Hold on. What is that? Oh, I have to register. All right, let's go see. I'm pretty sure we can customize it. I don't know that for a fact. I could be wrong. If we can't customize it, then we'll just take it out and check it out. But right now, I just want to see if we can customize it. Because I'm pretty sure we can add on things like this, like armor and stuff like that. All right, let's check it out. Because, I mean, we're in a we're in a workshop right now. That's just what I'm assuming. I'm probably going to have to get in it. Uh, I don't know how to do this. Hello? Uh, yeah, there we go. Okay, now we can access our vehicle workshop. All right, so it's pretty, basically like a car. Okay, let's do this. Uh, so let's put armor on this thing. Yes, I mean, it's not a fast car anyway, so we might as well just make it armor up. Brakes, yes. Engine, ooh, that must be on sale this week. That's pretty cool. Uh, horn, we gotta put, like, just a big old truck horn on that thing. No, we got two. Headlights, uh, sure, why not? I need to see. Uh, nope. Mm, put on uh, this with that, YOLO. Uh, <laughs> color, uh, what, what do the colors change? I'm assuming that uh, the other one does the trim, then. Yeah, so it does a trim. All right, uh, primary. Let's see what this thing looks good with. I kind of want to go with like a matte, something matte. Ooh, kind of white would just be out there, you know? Just very out there. Let's put on white real quick. Let's see what something else looks like with it as well. Uh, I kind of like the red one. Does that look stupid? Kind of looks stupid to me. Never mind. I'm going to go back. I don't like the way that looks. Uh, matte. Kind of want to go with the matte, though. Uh, matte red? That looks kind of cool. Some type of matte black. Yep, I'm going with that with a matte black. That sounds, that sounds, ooh, no. <laughs> that sounds pretty cool. Right, I'm going to go with that. I think that looks nice. Wait, wait, what if we went with white? Uh, I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm okay, I'm going to stick with that one. That one looks really cool. Uh, no, I do not want to exit. Okay, suspension. I want to keep this thing up. I don't want to lower it. I want to keep it up. It's a big monster. Uh, race transmission, sure. Turbo, sure. Wheels. Uh, what kind of wheels do you put on this thing? Off-road? I kind of want to put off-road on it. Yeah, I'm going to put off-road on it. Screw it. Uh, let's go with these. Those look cool. Color. Black it out. Players. Design. Yes, sure. Champions. Bulletproof. Sure. Black. Yes. And can we tint the windows? Yes. All right, cool. So you can't really put any more guns or anything on this thing. There's no option to put any more guns. So that's kind of weird. I was hoping there'd be, like, turrets that I could drive around and shoot people with, but apparently not. Uh, that's kind of cool. All right, let's head out with this thing. Uh, exit the garage. And let's check this thing out. All right, guys, here it is. It basically just reminds me of the MLC. <laughs> basically just a big old truck. All right, let's get out of this thing and check this out. It says use player scanner. I'm not exactly sure what that is. Oh, I know what this is. You may have used something like this before. The cops usually run with an outdated version of this on their Maverick helicopters. Mine is a little more powerful. It allows you to scan other persons of interest in the area and see a detailed breakdown of their combat info and any other dirt we can dig up on them. It's got some other features I can upload when we're running specific jobs, too. Alright, cool. So this thing, yeah, it scans them and pretty much tells you. I'm going to try this player right here. I did not know you could drive while using this. This is kind of cool. I'm driving right now, guys. I did not know that. Where is he? Is that him? That's not him. I think he's up on top of a building. Come down, man. I want to scan you. Alright, guys, here we go. I found a guy inside of his terabyte. Let's see this thing. Come on, it's scanning him. It's scanning him. There we go. We scanned him. Let's check out this thing. Oh, that's cool, guys. Did you see that? So it put up on screen. That was pretty cool. I like that. So basically, you kind of have to catch a player just kind of chilling out. I mean, it's hard to hard to lock on to this guy at the same time. There we go. We got it. So this is all his details, guys. Uh, total earnings, 5,000. Really, man? Rank, 300. Uh, player kills, 10,000. Player death, 6,000. He's not very good, gotta say. Favorite weapon, heavy sniper. That's kind of dangerous. Uh, favorite radio station. Don't know why I need to know that. Private dance is three. And sex axe purchase, six. That's kind of cool, guys. That is the new thing. Hey, what's up, man? Don't shoot me. Leave me alone, okay? Don't bully me. All right, let's get out of this thing, and I want to go check out all the other crap. All right, let's see here. So let's let's jump out. Let's go inside. Let's check out everything else. I want to check out the drone that we have. I want to check out those missiles. That's kind of cool. I like the player scanner. I don't really see why it's useful that much. I mean, I guess it, it could be useful if you're trying to check out, like, a guy, a, a potential enemy, and you want to see how many kills they've gotten, see if they're lethal or not. All right, let's get in here. Let's check this out. So what is this? I like how it doesn't tell you. You just kind of, it's just like sit down. Just go, just sit down. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, fly drone. All right, here we go, guys. Let's fly the drone around. Let's check this out real quick. Hey, the we're drone. on a drone. Okay. This is so cool. Out of this little guy. I like they it, man. How do I shock fragile, people? But they're super how do I select that? A punch. Uh, a decent range on one shock is truck, right bumper. Okay, I just need to know. Please come out. Stunner. Come out or here, man. I dare you. Mission. The detonator should take someone out. Alright, cool. So, the boost, I guess, will probably give me a boost. Yep, it'll give me a boost. 
This will probably get away in a sticky situation. The shock will shock people, and then the detonate button, well, as you could probably imagine, you'd sit there and you'd detonate, and then it would detonate. All right, I'm going to try and shock. I, I don't see any pedestrians around. I'm going to see if I can find a pedestrian. Okay, go, hold on. All right, guys, here we go. <laughs> yeah, we can taste people. Dude, that's really cool. I'm definitely 100% going to make a video with this. And then I guess, what's the what's button to detonate? Uh, you can just press this, and you can detonate, probably. Uh... Oh, I got that charge. So you can kill people with this thing. That's kind of cool. I don't know if it'll count as your kill or just a random kill, but that's kind of cool. You detonate it, and then boom. It's detonated. All right, that's kind of cool, guys. I really, really like the drone. I think that's pretty cool. Oh, I got, I got cops on me. All right, what else do we have? Oh, we have to wait. We have to wait one. So once you destroy it, you have to kind of wait one minute to be able to play with it, which I completely understand. All right, what's this thing? I'm pretty sure this is where all the missions get done. So after this video, I'm going to have to do five of these missions to get that Oppressor Mark II for the tra tra cheaper trade price. All right, where are my missiles? I don't understand. Where are my missiles? Where am I supposed to go for that? Uh, exit to cab? No, I want to. I want to get my missiles. How do you use the missiles? I bought missiles. Uh, I'm confused. There's, there would usually be another chair, wouldn't there? Uh. Alright guys, I officially cannot figure out how to deploy these rockets back here. I just cannot figure it out for the life of me. I've been inside of it looking at every single button. I've been in the inside of the front. I've looked in the interaction menu. There's a terabyte services, but there's nothing to there's nothing that does the uh, uh, rockets back there. So if you guys know how to deploy these so I can kill people with them, please let me know because I have no idea. Maybe you have to like have a second person in there. I know how to do I have no idea how to use them. I'll probably figure it out eventually. I'll probably just dick around with it and I'll eventually figure it out. But I want to get this video done so I can get it out to you guys as fast as possible so then I can buy the Oppressor Mark II. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go do five client jobs right now. I'm going to get this video out to you guys, and I'm going to buy the Oppressor Mark II. So if you guys want to see me buy that, play around with it, dick around with it, kill a bunch of people with it, uh, make sure you guys come back. Alright guys, that's where I'm going to end the video for the day. If you guys like the video, may press the like button. If not, that's cool. If you guys really like the video, may press the subscribe button. If not, that's cool too. That's completely up to you. I will talk to you guys in thy next video. Bye!